guys, Josh Horowitz back here live on the red carpet for MTV, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2. Emma, 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 we're live. How are you? Good to How see you. Good. You look Good. lovely tonight as always. Thank you so much. So, I saw you last in Pittsburgh. You were dancing up a storm. I was, I was. Were you dancing at the after party tonight? Yes. That is the one. I'm like, get me to that dance floor. That's exactly what I need right now. Well, now I know you have the moves. I was impressed, I have to say. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. So is it bittersweet tonight? Do you feel, what's the emotions yeah. running through your brain? I mean, part of me is, is relieved. You know, it's, it's been intense, but um, obviously part of me is pretty sad and kind of emotional. So it's, 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 definitely, it's definitely sad. What do you do the next day, the day after all of this stuff is over, whether it's tomorrow or a week from now? Once. Well, I'm usually working or like going on to the next thing, but it really is over now, so I'm, I don't know. I think I'll go and have a really big brunch, like a really big <laughs> brunch and sleep and just kind of try and reflect on the whole thing. Well, you're entitled to it. Um, what are you going to be, you think you're going to be broken down to tears when you watch the film again tonight? I saw your speech, your beautiful speech in London the other day. It um, must be tough to keep the emotions in check with things like this. Yeah, it is. Um, it's definitely been a... It's been a tricky juggling act for the tour to kind of like do my job and, and be professional, but then also kind of deal with how I feel about the whole thing. Um, but um, hopefully I've, I've walked, walked the right line. Um, yeah. Well, it's deserving. Ten years of accomplishment. You might as well get a few tears out. Well, thanks. <laughs> thanks. Congratulations, thanks. Emma. Lovely to see you. Much. You too. Thank you. The lovely Emma Watson, of course. Uh, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2 live red carpet coverage on MTV. And I think we're talking to Rupert. Rupert, there he is. <laughs> How are you, man? Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> You're sweating up the storm. I know I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Keep, yeah. Keeping cool. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm good. So, uh, I mean, what's the emotion? I was just talking to Emma. She clearly, you know, you feel you have to feel the emotion in something like this or not. Are you kind of like just going on, on fumes at this point? Um... Yeah, it's just a fluid feeling. I mean, this is very special because I mean, it is the last one, and this really is it. And it's it's going to be weird, kind of not having this anymore. I'm going to miss the the screaming. I just you don't get that every day. It's just it's just yeah, I'm going to miss that definitely. But, um, yeah. That uh, you know, we talked about the Harry Potter World Cup the other day. I have good news and bad news. You made it to the finals against Snape. Oh yes, the, the Snape Snape overtook you, man. Snape. Uh, I knew it. I knew it. You predicted it. I knew it. I would have, yeah, I mean, I'm, I agree. It's, it's the right, it's the right. You choice. have to vote for yourself. Maybe if you second. Came second. Did I come second? Yeah. That's it. I'm pleased with that. How does that make you feel to know the fans kind of? Yeah, it's great. Know. It really is. That does mean a lot. It does. It's, it's great. I mean, I'm really gonna miss, miss playing that character and these, these films. Yeah. I was asking Emma, what do you do the next day after all this publicity is done? She said she's gonna have a big brunch. What do you do to unwind a after big all? Big brunch. Big brunch. What are you gonna do to unwind after all of this? I don't know. I mean, I really don't know what 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 I'm supposed to do. Uh, <laughs> counseling and <laughs> lie down on the couch, yeah. just talk it all out. But um, yeah, I'll be there for you, man. If you need any help. <laughs> Thank you, Rupert. As always, good to see you, man. Rupert Grant, of course.